Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Dream Debo. I'm from Liberia. So today I want to talk to all the brothers around the world, all the brothers around the world, especially those living in the Western world. Bro, listen, there is something really going on that we must address. We shouldn't play deaf ears to. Listen, bro, to all of us that are so-called fathers, you know, all of us that have kids or children, let us own up to our responsibilities. Let's stop creating excuse for not catering to our children's needs and welfare. Let's stop it. It's not fair. You were never abandoned by your father. Even if you were abandoned by your father, God never abandoned you. These ladies, just because they are not in relationship with us, does not mean we shouldn't be in relationship with our children. Does not mean we shouldn't man up and own up to our responsibilities. I see these things going on so many times. Some people make excuses like, oh, she took me to child child, uh, child support and all that. That's why I'm not, I'm not going around her. I'm not going to see the kids. It doesn't make sense. She took you to child support, yes, because she couldn't get the support out of you the right way. She couldn't easily get support out of you for your own child. So that's why she took you to child support because she feels that that's the easier way she can get the child support out of you. Simple as that. And then you'll be all over the community. Oh, she took me to child support. She took me to child support. Yes, why won't she? Put yourself in that position. They are suffering. They're going through so much just to own up to the responsibility of the child by themselves. Or by, some of you have two, three, four, five children and you don't even care. But you live as men. You wear the best of clothes, groove, do the best of things, drive the best of car, travel, do this, do that. What's going on with our men, man? What's going on to the with the world? It's not fair. It's it's just it's just so dumb to me. It doesn't make sense to me. Why nobody talking about it? And I see people complaining. Oh, she told me to child support. She told me, to, yeah, she would. She would obviously. Listen, bro, you don't have to be in a relationship with this woman to take care of your child. No, you don't have to. If it's not meant to be, it won't be. If it's meant to be, it will be. Simple. But you have to be in a, in a relationship with your child. How can you do that? By manning up and owning up to the responsibility. Even if you have five, six, seven baby mamas, bro. The fact that you're meeting up to their responsibilities, taking care of your child, makes you still a responsible man. You're responsible for them. And guess what? In that way, you get a lot of blessings from God. It's just so bad that these children are growing just because they put your child support the two, three hundred dollars you pay every month to that to your child mom because of your child or children. And then you say you're not going around, you don't care to see the children. This is uh, you don't even take them to the activities, you don't help to, to, to upbring the child in the right way. And you sit there, you think you, you're a father. You're not a father, you're not a father figure. You need to man up, you need to grow up and understand that there's more to just saying, Oh, my baby mama, baby mama. You 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 just need to do something. Play your role as a man. Be respected. You don't have to be a married man, in fact. You don't have to. You just need to take responsibility. That's it. That's just it. You just need to be responsible for your child or children. Because they are yours. They are yours. And that's where God bless you. God open doors and windows. Have you wondered why some of our brothers have been overseas for one million years? Put it that way, so to speak. And they've got nothing going on in their lives. They don't even see the opportunities that other people see. People who come and make a name and make an impact and making money and making resources and making ends meet because of these simple things. You're not responsible for anybody, so God is not going to be responsible for you in a way. You're not being responsible for your own your own seed you planted into the lady's womb. So how do you expect God to be responsible for you? Guys, think, wise up, wise up. Oh, men, especially my African brothers, not just be straight out to my countrymen, Liberian, not just Liberians, but Nigerians, Sierra Leonean. Ghanaians, all of us, African men, men up. Men up and own up to your responsibilities. And on behalf of all the men who are not owning up to their responsibility, I let us say sorry to all the single mamas. I let us say sorry. I wish my brothers would listen to this and, 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 and gain some respect and gain some sense and own up to the responsibility. Thank you. God bless you, all of us. Bye-bye.